Hey guys, what's going on? I'm just playing GTA now. One of the first things, this is my very first, um, what do you call these? Uh, uh, like, I don't know, you watch it on YouTube, it's a video. <laughs> now, one of the most important things for me is I like to look very effeminate before I hit the streets. So I'm gonna go into my sweet ass closet here. Hold on, I forgot where it was. Downstairs. Uh, hold on, I gotta go downstairs, guys. Now this uh, this little uh, video blog or, or whatever you call it, this is for the real GTA gamers, okay? I'm not going to be showing you pictures of my dog and, like, sleeping and, you know, like, uh, like this guy, uh, like this dude, Hike the Gamer, showing me pictures of his fucking dog. Look at my dog, it's sleeping. <laughs> you fucking idiot. All right, so let's get really, really gay here, because style is very important to me on GTA. As you can see, I'm rocking the floral nut huggers, uh, and I think what I want to do is I'm just going to go with a turquoise short here. Shorts? Sports pants? No, I think I'm going to go shorts. Uh, let's see. These aren't, see, these kind of come down to his knees, and I don't really like that. I like to show a little more leg. So, I gotta, I forget where these are in here. Um, Chino's boots. Um, oh, jeez. Sports shorts? Oh, here we are. See, these are very low cut. Those are kind of cool. I like how the, uh, the purple goes right over my crotch. Plaid is nice. Hmm. He's got a nice, uh, he's got a nice bulge. I think I'm going to go with fruity floral running shorts for this session, guys, just for you. Here we go. All right, now we're, now we're almost ready to hit the streets. I, I don't know if you can see my mug, but I recently went to the hairdresser, and I dyed my hair blonde, and I went with a very, very um, metrosexual chin strap beard. And, of course, the... Wa the white watch, which is a nice accent. It really brings out his tan. Um, let me just find the door to get out of here. There we are. It's a very confusing house. And then, uh, you know, I like to warm up on the streets first. You know, I'm not like uh, like expert thief and, uh, you know, just throwing sticky bombs around like an idiot and calling people racists. I like to hit the streets real slow first. Just get warmed up to the virtual world, you know what I mean? So we're just going to hang out here. Ooh, Bahama Mamas. I bet you they got a lovely mango margarita there. Punch that guy in the face. See, you're just warming up here. Just getting a little warm up. Moving it around a little. Here's my truck. Let's get in this. And I think what I want to do, you know, the brown is a little masculine for me. So I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to head right over to uh, Los Santos Customs and pick out a color a little more suitable to my style. So let's head on over. Uh, I drive pretty recklessly. Um, and I just find that a really fun part of the game, just crashing into things and creating bedlam in the streets. That's really what it's all about, folks. Old school. So here we go. These monster wheels are pretty sweet. Although with such a masculine looking truck, I think it's only right to give it a very effeminate color. So we're going to head on over. Fucker. <laughs> Venice is, is known for their metrosexuals. I don't know if, if you're not from the Los Angeles area, which uh, this virtual world is based on, Venice equals gay. So here we go. Dun, 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 dun. Let's get some tunes going, huh? My, uh, my favorite, uh, I gotta say, you know, the music in this, in this version is fantastic. I think my favorite song is Eddie Murphy's My Girl Party is All the Time. And I think you can find that on Space uh, 1031 or something like that. Let's see if I can get it here. Low down. There we go, Space 103.2. Yeah, you know, those funky jams, just to 
get in the rhythm. That's what it's all about. There's another guy that makes a lot of videos. His name is, uh, what the hell, Syndicate Project. And uh, he's like got a, a wicked Irish accent and it's super annoying. Uh, especially if you're from the States or Canada. You know, you feel like just jamming a corned beef right down his throat and telling him to shut the fuck up. You know, enough already with the ar ar. All right, here we go. Now we're gonna jump in here and, and get this bad boy repainted. Before we get really nuts. Ding. Ding, 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 ding. Yeah. Look at that grill. That grill is fat. Uh, sure, we'll repair it, and then let's go down and respray this guy. Okay. Oh. Oh, excuse me. All right, I'm looking for something. Uh, the red is nice. Torino red is very, very uh, almost borderline abrasive. I'm gonna go with salmon pink for this for this uh, session, guys. And here we go. Now what I like to do first, after a couple minutes of warm-up, I like to, uh, you know, after I get my style situated and everything ready to go, I like to see if I can go crash into some people. So it looks like there's some melees going on in here. So let's head on over. We're going to drive fast and take chances. And here we go. Now we're just, you know, we're on the streets, we're warmed up, our thumbs are getting loose, especially if you have a severe... Uh, uh, carpal tunnel like I do you know you want to warm those bitches up Duh. there's this guy C Nanners that does a whole bunch of blogs and god damn is he annoying huh? <laughs> and gee whiz and how much horse shit can come out of one guy's mouth it's amazing <laughs> isn't it now what I also like to do normally when I'm gaming I have my friend over here uh, Ricardo Bougelet Hello. Uh, he's from the south of Spain. I am very passionate. And he, um, I, what I make him do, he's, you know, he's a Euro dude, so I just make him watch me. Yes. And, uh, you know, tell him to shut up. I'm pretty mean to him. Uh, and that's another added bonus to the game. It's like, not only am I just being a complete jerk in this virtual world, but I'm yelling at this guy from Europe, which is fun. Thank you very much. And uh, I just make them watch, but it's almost like I got somebody in the passenger seat, so it makes it fun, you know? I enjoy it very oh. much. Hang on a second. There we go. Where are you going? We are, uh, I'm going to head up to, it looks like, oh, there's another white dot right there. I'm going to just see if I can crash into some people. Go kill that guy. Hang on, you know what? I'm just feeling a little nuts. So let's get out of the truck. Let's start throwing some shit around. I mean, that's what this is all about. Here we go. There's a car down there, right? Blow that shit up. Ooh, is that a dude right there? Ugh. Little of that. You can see, also, I my guns are pink, too. It's one of my favorite colors. If you haven't picked up on that yet. Looks like there's a dude right up here. See what I'm saying? Come on, bitch. You should try to shoot him. Oh, sorry. Oh, I don't think he's quite there. Oh. What do you think of that? And then just uh oh, behind you. Oh, here, let's blow up his car. Yeah, there you go. Not bad, Ricardo, huh? I have to go. My, my wife is, uh, wants me to go home. Oh, hold on. Look, Ricardo. I have to go. Just stay put, bitch. This is not... Uh, oh, look at this bitch. What? You... Gonna die. You're gonna die. You're gonna die. Come on, Ricardo. You're gonna die. I need positivity. You're gonna live. Thank you. Ah, oh, it's so good to be GTAing with you bitches.
There we go. And then let's just blow this guy up, because he was being a real prick earlier. You know, that's what you get, buddy. There you go. Can't let anybody steal my pink truck. I think what we'll do now is we'll head up into the hills. It's one of my favorite areas. And, uh, you know, do some jumps and shit. Oh, no, my car's all fucked up. Look out, he coming. Where is he, Ricardo? Oh, there he is, a little fucker. Oh. But you blew him up. Yeah, I blew him up. I got him, Ricardo. So this is how, I mean, this is old school GTA. Okay, I gotta go. Where are you going? I have to go home. All right, I'll see you, Ricardo. Hasta luego. All right, hasta mañana, bitch. Buenas noches. You got it, pal. Adios. All right, don't forget the euro on the way out, all right, buddy? Gracias. All right, let's go do some jumps, guys. Gracias por todo. Adios. See ya. So we're going to head up into the hills and do some wicked jumps. Because that's always sweet. Going to head up here. I'm really, I mean, I'm like, a, I would consider myself a master GTA gamer. Pretty excellent driver. Um, and, you know, really, one of my big things, uh, you know, I know I dressed uh, a little effeminate and stuff, but I really like to play on the uh, the homophobic uh, undertones that everyone seems to carry around in this game. So I, I feel like that uh, it's almost like an advantage for me. It's intimidating when someone in floral shorts, running shorts, is coming after you with a large gun. So we're doing some jumps here. This is always fun. Alright, let's go blow some shit up. Uh-oh, I lost connection due to an unknown error. Hello? Uh, hello? Should we stop, Ricardo? Uh, no, no, I have to go. Uh, but I forgot my, uh, what do you call my wallet, my, my, my tarjeta. Mm. You continue, you're doing very good. Okay. I'll be back later. See you, man. Oh, my brother might stop by Esteban. Bye. I'm going to jump back online here, guys. Now, I think one of the, uh, one of the, the biggest uh, exciting things I do on this game is stealing the fighter jet. Now, I know people do this many, many different ways. I'm going to show you the absolute easiest way to do this. Um, it's very uh, to the point, and uh, usually, uh, probably at about eight times out of ten, you can get out of there. I might have uh, some friends popping in later, too, which will be fun. <coughs> Ooh, excuse me. But again, guys, you know, this is the uh, this is the blog for the real gamers. We don't want any fucking little bitches like Expert Thief on this shit. Hike the gamer with his dog fucking eating Triscuits and all that other bullshit. Sea nanners laughing like a fucking sea lion. You know what I'm saying? And certainly not Syndicate Project. I mean, come on, man. Don't you have, like, wars to fight against Britain or something? And you're playing GTA, buddy? I mean, go have a Guinness and do something. All right, we're back here. Back in the house. Uh, let's have a drink before we hit the streets. Let's see. Let's go over. I think it's uh, a nice uh, double-barreled whiskey. Get a little torqued here before we hit the road. Come on, drink it, bitch. You can also see, I, it, I think with the new patch, you were able to put a, a couple of pounds on your guy. Uh, and uh, again, I think that, uh, you know, he almost looks a little puffy, which 
for me makes him even more effeminate, which I don't, if you're into that, that's certainly uh, something you might want to look into. A couple of drinks down the hatch. Let's, uh, we're going to polish it off with a wine, uh, a, uh, a glass of wine here. Let's head on over. Have a glass of wine. Uh, you know, because we're sophisticated. That's what we do in GTA. Um, again, uh, this is uh, this is a blog. It takes a very feminine uh, approach to the game. And if you're into that, uh, you know, please, there'll be many more of these. Uh, so let's go. Let's hit the streets. Yeah, exit. Let's go. All right, here we are, guys. We're going to hit the streets again. And, you know, be, before we get into some uh, some riffraff, I, I want to thank Gary Olson, my producer. Uh, thank you very much. Thanks, Gary, again, for setting up the wires and stuff. I would never know how to do any of that. Not a problem. You know, uh, I just wanted to uh, inform you of the time. You're at 15 minutes. Oh, okay. Not sure what you... Uh, how long you wanted to go tonight? All right, let me just uh, let me grab a, a car here, and we're gonna head over and, uh -huh. and steal a fighter jet. After I'm gonna beat okay. the shit out of these people. All right, uh, that should oh. what, take about five, ten minutes. Maybe. All righty, I'll uh, I'll be right back. I'm gonna make a tall, stiff drink. No. How, do, how do I get in the garage, Gary? Uh, right there through the blue circle. Oh yeah, sorry. Enjoy. Um, uh, can I not get in? Uh, you've got cops on you. Oh, shit. Unfortunately, man. you're gonna have to shake them. Let me call Lester. Shake them up, shake them up, shake them up, shake them. I'm gonna call Lester, man. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. You might want to kill him. He's gonna run over you. Hi. How much are we talking about? Okay, okay. I'll make this happen. Slowest reflexes in the business. <laughs> I'll be right back. Sorry, guys. I mean, you're no sea nanners, that's for sure. Hey, come on, Gary. You know how I feel about those guys. And you remember Expert Thief in that last video where he was throwing sticky bombs from behind in his car? You know you can shoot in your car. That's a fake gangster, that dude, man. I don't, I don't, I don't do that. All right. Well, stop drinking too much of the haterade. Mix it up with a little bit of alcohol. Ah. <sighs> Nice stockings, by the way. Very nice. All right, guys, so we're going to head up to the, uh, fuck, what did I say? Uh, oh, yeah, we're going to steal the fighter jet. It's up this way. I like to get on my little motorbike, although, what, unfortunately, you cannot uh, make too many modifications to the motorbike. Uh, I would have preferred to have it bright pink, but uh, again, I don't know if that option's available uh, on the motorbike. So usually I just jump on it and hit it. Uh, this bike's also super awesome for just hitting the desert and doing wicked jumps. And, uh, you know, especially late at night if you've been drinking a little bit or you've been uh, abusing uh, other narcotics. It's also a uh, real fun time just heading up to the desert. Um, I prefer the motorbike over the dune buggy. It seems to have a little more uh, wherewithal, bigger jumping ability, uh, you know, that kind of stuff. If you're into that, if you're just into just going off, brah. Uh, oh. Uh, so, yeah, we're going to cruise up this, uh, the PCH here. And uh, I'm going to show you a really quick and simple way to get that fighter jet. Um, really fast. I, I know uh, some other people had some other ways where you're jumping fences and shooting at people and all that stuff. This requires none of that. Uh, you just get in, get out real fast, and hope nobody blows you up. And so we're here, and then hopefully we don't run into any fuckers on the highway trying to shoot us. Because you're a little more vulnerable when you're wearing a pink tank top on a motorbike. Uh, yeah, they can see you coming from pretty far away. Bum, da, 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 just hitting the streets, hitting the fucking street. Oh, 
I just got rolled. I'm going to show these guys how to uh, to uh, get the fighter jet really quickly. Okay, I um, just just so you know, there's plenty of videos out there. Uh, Hike the Gamer has done it several times. Uh, so is Expert Thief. Uh, We're going to do it my to think way. Think about as well. I think he's been doing it. There's a Lemon Lemon Head or Lemon Lemon Gamer. They're all gamers. Uh, it's kind of the first thing you do when online started. What? Steal the fighter jet? Yeah, go to the get the fire fighter jet. There's not that interesting. Oh yeah. But I yeah? guess if you're going dressed like that. Yeah, it makes it different. That's pretty unique. I'm, yeah, that's what I was trying to tell everybody that's earlier. That's a good point. You know? I mean, there's a large uh, gay community on GTA, and I, I'm just trying to call awareness to that and support of that because I know uh, sometimes when you get on these little chats, people are horribly offensive and rude. and They're bullies. Bullying. They're people. damn bullies. Yeah, it's disgusting all language. Be all because you like to smoke a little bit of pole? I don't see anything wrong with exactly. that. Exactly. And my point exactly, Express Gary. yourself. You must. You know, you want to vogue a little bit, if you would. Strike a pose. Now, I've, I've never bleached my hair before, but... Looks nice, right? I've been thinking about it. So you want to hit this little jump right here. You're going to veer off right here. You're going to hit this bitch. Oh, we didn't do it right. Uh-oh. Oh. Thank God he didn't lose his black boots. Well, it's not a, it's not It's certainly not a show about gaming prowess, is it? And on that note, we're going to end this session because uh, I failed a couple of times here. Oh. I'm going to go have a scotch and water. I'm going to be right back. And, oh. Uh, maybe uh, we'll post this one and, and see if you guys like it or not. Sounds, sounds good. All right. I'm signing off. Signing off. This is Mitch Thornberry, and I'll see you guys real soon. Bye. <laughs> yeah!